So back in October, November, it was time for me to start filming my upcoming psychological thriller short film. I had planned to shoot the majority of the film here in my apartment. Since I have access to my apartment all the time, it enabled me to prepare and try things, set dress it and make it look messy and dark and scary and try things. Placing the camera and uh, using myself as a stand-in just to make sure I knew what kind of angles I wanted to get. Just prepare everything as much as possible before the week and we were about to shoot the film. As a filmmaker it's almost like a luxury to be able to try things on set months before you even start rolling camera. So I went online to find actors and Caroline Ilea and Andreas Lindberg, they were up for coming down here to Malmo and be a part of this project. So before we started shooting we had a couple of online meetings where we could discuss their characters and their motivations and my idea of the, the short film. And this was very necessary because for example, Caroline, she had to take a train ride for six hours to come down to Malmo. So I felt like I really wanted to make sure I did everything I could just to keep the shooting schedule as effective as possible. So we started shooting Saturday in late November and on the evening, on the Saturday, I made a quick rough cut of what we shot during the Saturday just to be able to see if there were something I've missed. So on Sunday we started to, to do some pickup shots from Saturday and just continue the rest of the shots on Sunday. I left the apartment in this horrible state a couple of days just to go around and shoot some close-ups, those kinds of shots where we don't really need the actors in shot. And after doing all of those pickups by myself, I realized that yeah, we actually did everything we needed to on these two days. And I owe a lot to my actors because they, they came here very prepared and we didn't have to do a lot of retakes. So I also had another scene that didn't take place here in this apartment, but outside in a tunnel, showing my characters as kids. So I found Josephine and Edgar. They were a lot of fun to direct. So all in all, the filming took about four days total. I was shooting the behind the scenes footage with my DJI Action 4 camera, which you're watching through right now. So what I did, I placed my Action 4 camera here. And also you have all of these pockets where you can put your pencil and your uh, messed up uh, script, bottle of water or uh, antidepressants. So you look like a damn fool, but uh, it sure is convenient. So next up for Production Diaries is uh, post-production and I believe I will be releasing the movie before my Production Diaries are over because there are some things I want to talk about but are very much spoilers. So, so we'll see how I'll be releasing things in the future. That's all I got for now. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!